Today I got an email inviting me to try out this new 5K player. Okay, now lately I downloaded Windows 10 and we're all very disappointed with its media player. And there's not many options at all in Windows 10 for media player. They will charge you $15 to allow you to play DVDs on it. And a lot of other players you can download that play 4K you must have to pay for this one plays 4K, 5K, which I'm not sure is even available yet. I certainly don't have it. 1080p, DVD, and radio online. And it's good for Mac and Windows. We're going with Windows today. I'm going to try it out because also I have VLC Media Player, which my friend recommends a lot. He's pretty good with computers. Um, and I don't like it. I really don't like it. And I don't like QuickTime. I was used to the old media player. But I'm going to try this because I'm open for a new player. And it's free. So we're going to download this and try it out. Free download for Windows. Thanks for downloading. Did I download yet? Yeah, I guess I did. Find the installer, double click the program, click yes, follow the instructions. Okay. Finished downloading. Now down the bottom here it says run, which I'm going to click on. Run. Yes. Setup wizard. Next. Let's see. Of course you know you have to accept this or you can't try it, right? And you know they can put anything you want in there, of course. But I trust them. Next. Program files, alright. Deer mob, it's called. Or Deer Mob. See that? 5K player. Next. 5K player. Uh, desktop. Quick launch. Okay. I don't know about quick launch. Desktop I want. Install. Here we go. Installing Bonjour. Launch player. Finish. That was quick. Oh, there it is. Look. And also, you can go to. Well, oh, that's nice and clean. Let's see. Let's see how it looks here. You can also go to YouTube and a lot of other video sites and download right from there. Like, you could paste a link in there and download it and convert it if you want. You can rip DVDs. Let me see, where am I? Movies, music, videos. Uh, let's go back to home. Let's see. Um, let me open one of my videos see how it goes. Okay, I've tried this out for a couple minutes. I'm really looking for a good player, you know. Well, it seems to play music okay. Let's try something quick. I can't play that. Uh, I mean, I can't for copyright and when you pause it does that that's okay and then I went to one of my videos that I made with uh, my camcorder and all I'm right a little disappointed look Brakes at that are on. see that see the graininess the in there compressed already you see these little notches I'm not happy with that on the back there's a tab watch look at it. on the back all right that's 1080p that I recorded it in and let me see that and although as good as bad as media player is it plays fine in there and everywhere else so look all right brakes are on no, it's frozen very well. calipers compressed already see you see that? these little notches I'm not impressed with that so I don't see any reason why I should keep looking around at this thing I was open-minded and I wanted to give it a try um, check the radio, let's see. Oh, it's just links, see. Alright, that plays, but... Um... Anybody can go on the internet and get, uh, <laughs> radio stations, right? How do you go back? 
All right. I'm sorry. Look, I don't know how to go back. No big deal, but. Seems to not be functioning at this point. So, clicking on what's happening. Alright, that's 10 millimeter, let's tell you. Clip. Well, I'm disappointed in this. I'm sorry, I wanted to give it a good review. Okay, that's my review. If uh, you know a better player out there, uh, let me know. I don't see why I should have to pay Windows $15 to get a fuller version of their media player. Maybe they'll come out with a better one, if we complain enough. Okay, stop back. We'll be checking more stuff. Have a good day.